What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Man, it's your girl Tiffany and I'm back at it with another video. Um, still out the little Airbnb that me and my daughter just posted, a, uh, just actually recorded a video last night. It's not posted, but by the time you guys watch this video, it will be posted. So if you guys haven't watched that video with my daughter, please take the time out, go watch that video, let me know what you think. I'm about to get ready to get out of here and just spend some more quality time with my daughter. And I thought I'll pick up my camera and record this video. Um, it's going to be different like all the rest of my videos, like I always say. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's just really just seven different hacks, tips, advice, however you guys want to take it. Just parenting 101. Seven things that helped me with raising my children. And I thought maybe it could help someone who maybe is raising a child, who may be having a child, maybe a sibling, you know, something that you could spread to somebody else. So sit back. It's not going to be so long. I'm trying to stop talking so much, but I like talking. So sit back, enjoy, and we're going to get right to the video. I. Alright you guys, so the first parent 101 hack that um, I could try to give anybody when having kids or raising kids or know someone who is maybe having kids or anything like that, one advice or hack, however you want to take it, that I would give you is love unconditionally. You have to love unconditionally. Alright, so the second thing on my list. Um, when parenting, parenting one-on-one, it's a advice, it's a hack, it's a tip, however you want to take it. But the second thing you have to do when having kids or raising kids or getting into a relationship with somebody with kids or be, you, anything with children, anything with children, you have to sacrifice. You have to sacrifice. You cannot, ladies and gentlemen, you cannot have a child and think that you can't sacrifice. All right, you guys. So, we are on the third thing that I would try to encourage anybody who's having kids, raising kids, um, brother, sister, it don't matter. Anything that got to do with kids, but raising them right. And one thing I would give advice to, the third thing is, and you take this how you want it, but you have to be your children's bodyguard. But don't be a bully. Aren't you guys? So we down to the number four thing that I would give somebody. I would, it's like a hat. I don't know, a tip, a trade, advice, however you guys want to take it. But the fourth thing that I would give any advice to anybody that's having kids, having babies or whatever. And this really got to me when my kids got a little bit older, but they grow up. They lied to me. Them cute little babies, them things grow up. They go from cute little smelling all good and whining because they want a bottle or they need to be changed or waking up two, three o'clock in the morning, you know what I'm saying? They all oh, they so cute, you can dress them in these little cute clothes. I mean, you know, they're so cute. And then they turn two and they're still cute. They're just a little bit touchy, 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 touchy. And they turn to about five or six, telling you no. Eight, having their own mind. 10, 11, 12, asking you why. 14, 15, 16 with attitude. <laughs> 18, 19 thinking they know it all. So just remember, they grow up. The number five thing that I would advise anybody, a hack, a tip, a trade, whatever, is enjoy your children. Enjoy them. Enjoy your children. We get so caught up, parents, parents, guardians, grandparents who's raising children, aunties, uncles. We get so caught up into raising our kids. You know, just want to work, provide, shelter, send them to school, and then do it all over. We really forget to enjoy them. Like, we enjoy them while they're young because we have to. They running around, causing a hack of math most of the time. So cute. Say amazing and darling things. But as they get older, we stop it. Really enjoying our kids. It's just like, oh, just, just raise them. I want to raise them right. Start enjoying your kids. All right. So, the number six thing that I would 
try to tell any parent who's raising kids or maybe need some help, single mothers, single fathers, grandparents, anybody that's raising children in this generation, if that's what I could say. Um, one thing that I would say with this generation, because I think it really kind of, I know it made us who we was, my generation, the 30, 30 and over crew, you know, it really made us who we was. And we some beasts, we some goats. But one thing that it, I know it messed me up is when a kid turns 18, and I don't know if it happened in other cultures, but I know it's really a big thing in my culture. That's, I know that's a big thing. Um, when they turn 18, they're not grown. So let's stop putting our babies out at 18, okay? Let's stop doing that. You 18, you grown, no. I so the number seven thing, I'm so glad I put this in that number seven because I want it to be last. I really want it to be last. But the number seven thing is, you guys, if you having children, if you didn't have children, you're helping raising children, your mom, your dad, your your anything that's around children, all right? Filter your mouth when it comes to them babies.